about to get ready to get down to the bottom of this situation and figure out what happened last week with the stabbing situation. Let's get it popping, y'all. Let go. Team, stop the bottom. Um, I have Sandre right here. Last week I heard it was bad in here at MATC. How did you feel about that? Well, I just feel like that was so uncalled for at school. I'm thinking I'm getting my education. I come to police, the whole crime scene, somebody getting stabbed. And I'm like, what? I'm supposed to be in class, not watching this. I'm like, hmm, maybe I should change my classes to Ohio. <laughs> like, is it safe to stay here? Everybody calling me, like, you okay, you okay? I'm like, what happened? This is all over the news. Everybody's scared. I'm like, oh, we're going to get a shit, okay? So, now we got to worry about it. This one. Well, she actually didn't even up here, so now we got to see if she okay. We need to find a stand, everything. I don't see why school is open to the public anyway. That's how she just got in. That's crazy. That's real crazy. Well, I appreciate it. Y'all, your boy Big Mike, Big Mike Tom, we still alive at MAT City. We have Samantha right here and Adriana right here. How do y'all feel about the last Um, I just feel very unsafe. I feel as if anybody could walk in, you know, and harm. But our teachers was just trying to tell us that it wasn't, you know, he wasn't gonna harm none of us, but I still feel very unsafe. Yeah. Um, I feel as if somebody uh, they should have canceled class is what I feel. They talking about somebody came up in here and was threatening all. First of all, it's a lot of kids here. But, I mean, it just disturbed everybody. Like, we saw the blood. We went up to the third floor. It was just a lot of commotion. Wow, you actually saw the blood. Yeah. How, did, how did it feel seeing that? I don't know. It just was, it felt unreal. Like, really. It just, you know, you know, it was, you know. And then the janitor was like, well, this not our job to clean this up, so. It was just a lot. Wow, that's crazy. Yes, it was very sad. I, I even cried. Do you feel safe in your school now? I mean, I feel safe, but I know now that I have to watch out. You know, watch what's going on. Yeah, it's a sad situation. But I appreciate y'all being on camera, man. Can I get Team Stop the Violence on camera? Team Stop the Violence. Just one of y'all. It's your boy Big Mike. It's Big Mike Tom. We have Brad right here at MATC. How you feeling, Brad? How you feel about the stack situation that happened last week? Well, really it was a pretty weird situation. I didn't really expect it. I just came out of class when I saw it all. But uh, as far as safety wise, I think I'm still safe. Just, I don't know, I think they should do a little bit of a better job trying to make sure that this doesn't happen again. Though. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Big Mike. It's Big Mike Tom. We still live here at MATC. Right here, I have Janet. How you doing, Janet? I heard about a crazy situation that happened here last week at MATC about the stabbing situation. How do you feel about that? Uh, well, I feel like if the necessary precautions were taken, um, I need like to make sure all the other students were safe. Um, I mean, I was told that this was something that just happened out of the blue. Um, just as long as anybody else wasn't hurt. What's going on, y'all? It's your Big Mike. It's Big Mike Town. We're still at MATC. Right now, I just went to Steve. Steve, what's going on? How you feel about that situation that happened last week? The stabbing situation. Well, the stabbing situation, and the PD knows how to work. I feel like it's a good thing. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Big Mike. It's Big Mike Town. We still out here at MATC. I just bumped into Najee. Right? How you doing? I'm good. How you doing? I'm doing real good. How do you feel about that stabbing situation? I feel like it shouldn't have happened. I feel like that shit should never be down. You know, it's making me feel like this environment not safe for me to be here. But you know, 
guard though. <laughs> so, and I, I just really feel like security should have been on top of it more. Dude that stabbed her, was he still I'm not sure. He shouldn't even been here if that was the case. He shouldn't have been here. That shouldn't have happened. Yeah, it was just all wrong. So do you feel safe in this Yeah, I mean, you know, but I'm on point though. I'm watching because, you know, you, ne you just never know. There's so many people here. What's up, your boy Big Mike is Big Mike Town. We here in the lunch area. I just bumped into Amber. How you doing, Amber? Good, how are you? I'm doing good. Are you enjoying your lunch? Yes. That's real good. <laughs> how do you feel about the staff situation that happened here last week? Um, I mean, I think it was crazy. It was very unexpected. I didn't think that this school would be so, you know, you know as I can say, so quickly as the school year started. I mean, I came. Right after it happened, that's because my class started at 10 30. Mm -hmm. So I'm assuming it happened a little earlier prior to that. Mm -hmm. And somebody told me it happened in the C building on the third floor. So I'm there a lot, that's where most of my classes are. Mm -hmm. So it kind of resonated with me. But I don't really know what happened. Mm -hmm. How do you feel? How do you feel about it? It could have been prevented, I'm sure. I mean, maybe there should be some more security or like, you know, so, you know, Everest. No, not Everest. I know uh, Brian and Stratton, you have to go through the, the techniques, mm -hmm. the techniques, so maybe that could have prevented something. I don't know. And do you feel safe in your school now? What's up, y'all? It's your boy Big Mike. It's Big Mike time. I'm out here with Slick. What's going on, Slick? Hey. I mean, you know, being where MATC is at, you know, MATC have a, a lot of good opportunities, you know, for those who take the opportunities and use them to their best ability. But, you know, it's like it's, we already look, look down upon as minority or whatever the case may be, you know, stuff like that only makes them look down on us even more. So, you know, cer certain people just need to, you know, take the opportunities given to them and, and leave well enough done, you know, what happened shouldn't have happened, I don't know what, what it happened for, but it's not justifiable because, man, this is a place of higher learning and learning, and, you know, it's giving people a bad experience, you know what I mean, so talk, people just talk. need to grow up. What's up, y'all, should wait Big Mike, it's Big Mike time, right now, I'm getting stupid, you I'm out here with Jamel and Rebecca, how do you guys feel about the situation that happened here last week? I was actually just not too far from where it was, and just to hear about how it happened. It was just a scary place, very environment. It's like, uh, it's like you're kind of you're kind of in a war zone right here. So it's like no way to protect yourself. It's just a lesson that you can't really trust everybody. So it's a pretty scary situation. Hey, what about you? What's up, everybody? It's your boy Big Mike. It's Big Mike Tom. We back here live at MATC. We have Jason right here. How you doing, Jason? Pretty good. How are you? I'm doing good. How do you feel about what happened last week? The stab situation. Uh, yeah, the stab situation was like very surprising to me, like because I didn't expect that to happen here at MATC downtown. Because like one, Milwaukee used to be a peaceful city around here until like that happened, and basically some stuff happened in the wrong city. But like basically, I'm kind of sick of sick of it. Pretty much, uh, people like taking violence out in the schools, like, it doesn't matter where you are, high school, middle school, or college, that shouldn't be happening anywhere. And basically, we're trying to, like, get our, get our education and basically do what, what we need to do and be successful. And But the situation with with, it, with stabbing, I'm like, to me, that's not really a good idea, just to do that to somebody who didn't do anything to you and have a history like that. Mm -hmm. That's crazy, you know what I'm saying? So, do you feel safe here at MATC? It, it kind of got me a little bit worried. Okay. But I think I could, I'm safe around here, uh, and knowing that we have police that close and two Excuse and security me. around here, that will let us know what happened, what's going on, and what happened. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Big Mike, it's Big Mike Town. We out here in front of MATC in front of the Stupid Center. I just bumped in to Meek. How you doing, Meek? Fine. How you feel about that situation that happened last week? I feel like you should have a little technique for security. It shouldn't happen. Yeah. 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 Y